Ninth grade can be a big year of change for any student. That is certainly the case for the freshman you're about to meet. Adeline Schultz can now say she's a published poet. In the halls of high school, bravery can look like many things. It's definitely a question worth considering. Coon Rapids freshman Adeline Schultz brandishes hers between two covers. I guess it was a little bit scary just to think that people might get a general idea about who I am based on what I write, but then I realized I shouldn't really be scared though because people are going to have ideas about me no matter what I do. Titled Listen, Addie recently published a book of heartfelt poetry. She began writing in earnest in the seventh grade. Just a little more than two years later, Addie released her first collection through Kindle Direct Publishing. I try to make poems that other people will be able to relate to and be like, yes, this is what it's like right now. This is what I'm feeling. <laughs> Addie is part of the math league at Coon Rapids High School and a volunteer at her local library. She also has a love of words. I guess when I read it just kind of feels like time doesn't exist. Even in a few stolen moments between classes, Addie immediately reaches for a book. I mean, people have this way where they can just arrange words and sentences. I feel like they're kind of like magical with the words. It was at a local author fair, like this one hosted by Anoka County Library, that Addie got the push she needed to put her words out into the world. What should I do to the people that left me? I could write a poem or draw a picture, but in the end it wouldn't matter. Therefore, I will compose a symphony, one of immense emotion, and when at last I die, its sound will perhaps be let out into the world. It's Addie's first grasp at making some magic of her own, with a courage beyond her years. I'm doing something that I'm really happy about and something that I have wanted to do for a very, very long time. Listen by Adeline Schultz is now available for purchase on Amazon in paperback or for Kindle. Addie dedicated her book to one of her former teachers at Coon Rapids Middle School.